Hi there, it's a big day for me and I wanted to share it with you. It's the launch today of my first ever photographic exhibition in the United States and I'm here in Escondido, uh, just outside San Diego at this beautiful gallery, The Photographer's Eye. I'm delighted and honoured to be showing my work here. So I'd just like to take you on a little tour of the show, so come with me. So this show is a two-woman show. I'm sharing it with an immensely talented underwater photographer called Marie Tartar. So the premise of this show is a journey through nighttime with African wildlife. And for me on safari, there are four stages tonight. So the four stages each have a wall here. Let me take you through them. The dusk wall is all about the golden hour, first of all, when even animals that are regarded as pretty drab can be elevated to absolute beauty. Then we go through the blue hour, and as the predators start to wake up, the light fades towards dark. The dark wall itself follows nighttime activity. Many animals come down to drink at water holes during the drought months, and they risk running into predators to access those life-sustaining waters. It's also a time where we might confront our own fears in the darkness and colours start to become secondary in the night time. Texture comes to the fore with the darkness itself often defining form. The dreaming wall uh, represents the subconscious state that uh, I enter as my mind processes all of the previous day's encounters uh, as they fall asleep and, and on either side of sleep. It's quite difficult to convey um, how, how it feels to me. So it's taken quite a complex mix of extended shutter speeds, intentional camera motion, different lens manipulations, and also the stacking of images to achieve uh, these, uh, the ones on this wall. And then the dawn wall is just simply bursting with new light, new life, and the new hope that the start of each new day Brings. And as always, I'll be donating a minimum of 10% of the proceeds of my sales to Gorilla Doctors, the fantastic veterinary service that is saving that species one gorilla at a time. Fantastic work that they do. And uh, on the two gorilla pictures in this particular exhibition, I'll be donating 100% of the proceeds to Gorilla Doctors. So I hope you've enjoyed the sneak preview of my latest work. It opens tonight in Escondido near San Diego. And uh, yeah, thanks a lot for watching.